In this Blender 2.81 tutorial, I will show you how to create a simple split screen video clip. I've assumed you have a basic understanding of editing in Blender. A link to my beginner's tutorial is included in the description below for those that don't. Other tutorials can be found in my playlists. Okay, well, I've brought three clips in, or sorry, four clips into Blender and I've spaced them apart, just makes a little bit, it makes it a little bit easier. And I've also edited them so that they're all the same length and also I've removed the audio. You can keep the audio for one track or all of the tracks, depends on what you propose to do with your split screen. Um, or you could add some audio to this as well if you want. But for ease, I'm going to just render this initially without any audio. OK. So, starting with the top track, I'm going to just select the top track by left clicking on it. And rather than using the shortcuts, I'll come over to the Add button. And then next to Effect Strip, I'm going to left click on Transform. Now you need to be to the very right hand side uh, in the strip select tab I was in proxy um, but anyway we'll go to strip so you'll see something called effect strip um, above it it should say transform so the first thing you need to change is it may not be open what you need to do is just left click on adjust and then left click next to compositing and it'll say blend if you just left click on uh, sorry replace if you just left click on replace and then select alpha over it won't matter on this top one so much but you'll see why well, you need to do this when you come down to the next video um, and there's a little box next to uniform scale just left click on this and now you can change the scale or size of your video to suit what you want to do. So I'm going to keep this tutorial quite simple so I'm going to literally type in 0.5 and hit return and this will place this video clip over the one below and this is the reason why we selected alpha over. If I hadn't selected that you wouldn't have been able to see the video below this one. Okay. So I'm going to place this in the top right hand corner and to do that, you'll see a box that says position X, position Y. So in position X, I'm going to type in minus 25. And again, you can move these to manually position your video. So if you're not going to do the same as what I'm doing here. But anyway, for this tutorial, I'm going to type in on the Y, 25. And this will put it slap bang in the top left hand corner. I'm going to select the next video and again go to add. You can use short uh, shift A if you want and then effect strip, left click on transform. And again, change the blend replace to alpha over. Place a tick in the uniform scale box and again I'm going to type in 0 0.5 to half this video and this time I'm going to put it in the top right so in scale X I'll type 25 and scale Y 25 you don't have to do this this is just how I'm creating this simple split screen so that's fine Let's do the one below, so select the one below, add, then effect strip, transform. Now you may want to leave this like um, with three um, videos. So again, just make sure first of all you change the blend replace to alpha over because we've got one more to do to finish this tutorial. But like I said, you may if you've got three clips want to change this on the Y axis and you could do something like this but I'm going to place this in the bottom right hand so let's go 
25 in the X and minus 25 in the Y and for some reason that's gone wrong and the reason for that is I haven't changed the scale so uniform scale and then 0.5 and that's put this one in this corner here so all these figures you can change incidentally you can keyframe them as well by placing keyframes um, to change the size but I won't go into that so we got one more video here so I'll just drag this down select the last video I'll go up to add effect strip transform and this one you probably won't need to change anything here um, you should find that the replace works fine um, so again uniform scale 0.5 hit return and this one I'll make this one X minus 25 and Y minus 25 and ah, jobs are good un. okay I won't even try to play this I know it will cause all sorts of problems um, and I shan't go into rendering like I said at the beginning I assume you've got some knowledge of editing in uh, Blender I shall render this now and it will be the video that you originally saw at the beginning of this tutorial so hopefully that's helped somebody Thank you for watching. Cheers.